What is up, YouTube? We are back with another adventure, another episode of the exciting adventures of our boy Farkle P on his journey to 110. In the last episode, we did some PvP. We got a draw. Now, I was surprised on that because that rarely ever happens for me. It's either win or lose. But a draw is nice because it's just like, hey, we didn't lose. We didn't win and we didn't lose either. So it's kind of like, hey, I'll take that. I will take that. Spamming the jump key. <laughs> I like spamming the jump key. I like about enhancement shamans is your lightning bolt is instant. Your lightning bolt and your chain lightning are instant. The chain lightning actually is still a thing on enhancement shamans. I think it's just. Farsight. You can put that over there. I don't really need that one on my action bar. Alright, so our boy Fargo P is now level 13. Let's keep it going. Oh, I forgot to do... I forgot to grab first aid. We'll do that on. We'll, we'll grab first aid on our next trip. To I'm out of range. This should be relatively soon. Uh, for professions, I don't think I'm gonna pick up any professions for this. I mean, I might pick up mining for him just because extra experience, and that's always awesome. But other than that, I don't think I'm gonna be picking any professions for a boy Farkle P here. I mean, I'm, like I said, I'm, I might do mining, and then I guess I could do engineering on him, so he could use those cool flying mounts I showed you on the very first episode of our event, or the very first episode of the second episode of our adventures of our boy Farkle P. Um, I guess I could do engineering on him. That would take me a really long ass time to level up engineering, and I mean, I could do it, but it would like I probably won't have it. I probably won't even have it like enough until like level 100 because I'll be focusing more on questing in this. Uh, when I do this, if I do level the engineering, I will be leveling it off off camera or off screen. I mean, because it'll just it'll just cut into our it'll just cut into our video time if we if I mean not we if I level the engineering on screen. Boston, it'll just cut into the video time. So that's like video and I think I think I've already made like two 30, 40 minute videos. So I get I mean I guess my original plan was to make these like 30, 20, 30 minutes. But I guess I guess I end it when I end it. So if I get like a 30, 40 minute video or you know whatever, I guess that's how it works. Okay. We need to 
go back to that cave. That cave that I went before that I went ahead of myself to go back to that cave. And then we'll come back to this lady and do her quest thing. Because her quest line is a little it's a little different and it actually goes into a different area. It actually leads us to the crossroads. But once we hit crossbows, we're actually gonna take the we're actually gonna take the flight path back to Oldemar so I can actually get my professions and my first aid so we can just <laughs> craft some bandages for our white farm P so that we can use them. Instead of having to waste our mana to heal ourselves during our adventures. That's actually a lot. Like I said, I will be leveling up my profession off screen. We can piece out of this cave. Oh, actually, let's loot this guy. See if he has any cloth. No, just copper. What about this guy? Do you have anything for me? I see have anything. No, just copper. Oh, you're wrong. Copper's good. No, we need cloth. We need linen. We can make some cool bandages or some bandages for our boy. And now we do mana.
Rooktar. Strength. Okay, that's our resurrect. We'll put our resurrect. Actually, no, we're gonna put our resurrect right here. And we are now level 14, people. Let's go. We might actually level out of our bracket before we hit it. Before we get into the next GP, we might actually level Speak, up the bracket. Speak, friend. Be safe. Oh, wait, no, 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 no. I remember, I remember, I remember. You don't love, you can't level out of your bracket. Until, like, Glory level 19. To the when I hit 20, I'll level out of this bracket. So I remember now. They put, they made the, they changed the brackets. Strength and honor. Yeah, it's like a better guy, whatever you want. 
Zug Zug. May your blade never die. King me that if you if you type king me in chat it means pass me lead basically Guy's clearly dead. Another alarm! He's just gonna, alarm he's just gonna spam shit. Okay. Remember dead. the sun well for Anastarian! Yeah! That guy is. A, if you're enjoying this guy as much as I am, <laughs> that is that's awesome. I guess Woo! this guy this, yes! this guy makes me want. This, this guy makes me the want to just scream Dora fucking shut up because he's annoying. For the glory of Quill Thalos! Yeah! Yeah! This guy is yeah! a moron. He's just a dick and a moron. Yeah! 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 I wish you could For really- Anastarian! I wish you could ignore people in this game. I wish you could just like silent them. Quilfellas. Like they can't even do this. Just like, the you, like even if they do it, you're prevail. not hearing it. Remember. 
remember the sun well! I ate a fucking belf, you knob! I don't know what the sun well is, I ate a belf! I don't know what the fucking sun well is, you fucking moron! I'm not a blood elf! Okay, I know what the sun well is, but I'm not a blood elf, so I don't have to remember shit about the sun well. So, yeah, you get that out of your head, buddy boy. Now, if you like blood elves, and you know you actually have a little, if you actually you actually have a blood elf, and you want to remember the sun well, you go right ahead. But I'm a orc, man. All that matters to me is getting pork. Pork, boys. Fucking pork in the will of the will of the war chief. That's what matters to orcs. Fucking pork in the will of the war chief. Let's go. Let that tank warrior grab that. We'll all just follow him. Fucking stay packed, boys. Tight like a pack. Let's go. About to beat some motherfuckers. I motherfucker. I dare one of the motherfuckers. I dare my one of the mother. I dare one of these motherfuckers to come up to my flag carry. About to fucking try to beat their ass. I say try because I might not succeed. Hey, I might die, but hey, I say try. I say I'm gonna try to beat his ass. This motherfucker. I'm not a healer, so here's hoping this guy here's hoping this guy knows how to play a tank warrior. Or at least has enchanted boas, so you can do some decent amount of damage. So that if I actually have the heal surge spam, it doesn't, you know, it doesn't affect me much. It doesn't affect my mana much in case I need it for myself. Paladin, yeah, he's a okay. He's a paladin, so she's a, he's a paladin, so he can he can silence people. So we have we have interrupts here. All right, it's just two of us though, though. But I mean, so that's kind of bad.
I hate hunters. He comes in and he just does whatever the fuck he wants, idiots. Fuck y'all noobs. Tell me to shut my pie hole. I'm trying to help y'all motherfuckers win. But I guess I guess Horde just never wants to win at low levels, cause you either get the the tie because your team didn't want to do shit versus the other flag carrier or kill him. So it's just endless ties or just endless defeats because your team is retarded. I I, I, know, I literally know no other way to describe Horde at low levels. Horde at low levels in PvP is just they're just idiots. I, I know literally no other way to describe Horde at low levels other than pure fucking stupid. I, just, I, I don't know any other way to describe Horde at low levels. I'm sorry if you're a Horde main. I'm an Alliance main, so I'm used to winning all the time in PvP. But for the sake of this journey, for the sake of the journey of our boy Farkle P, I'll suffer. <laughs> Fucking help me, so I mean, we don't have any fucking healers in this match. So, yeah. They have healers. We don't. We don't have a single fucking healer right now. We literally don't have a single fucking healer right now. It's, it's, it's retarded. It, it's honestly retarded. Like, you figure as much low level, as much low level tweaks as people make, you figure somebody would have made a healer tweak. Our boy Farkle P here, he ain't a tweak, but we're actually leveling him, but still. Maybe the fact that some of these guys deal double my damage, because some of these guys are actually twigs, which is okay. They returned it. is doing one doing consistent damage like with the poison like with the poison thro throwing the poison freaking poison knives at me or something is that like a is that like a freaking gnome gnome hunter passive or something because i don't see that in any other type of hunter is that like gnome is that like gnome exclusive or something like if you're watch if you watch this and you know something about that please let me know because it's, it, it's annoying as fuck and it's it's getting on my nerves like i need to know what the fuck this guy's doing Oh! <laughs> 
we actually have a healer and she's just garbage? Wow, okay. The sad part about that gnome is I don't think that gnome has a single boa. And he's still beating the shit out of me because he's throwing some sort of poison darts that I can't freaking that I can't evade. And that are dealing like half of my health in one shot. Because I have never seen those darts, those like poison dart things on any hunter. Like, I'm wondering if that's just gnome exclusive or that I'm hallucinating that he's been throwing those at me. Describe that guy except pure retarded. The fact that we won was because of that Pandaren hunter who was doing a shit ton of damage and actually capped the flag instead of trying to run around with it like a headless chicken like the group before, like the group before we got that other win. Or like the group before we got that draw. I mean, running around with the flag like headless chickens, I have no fucking idea what to do with the flag once you get it. I hate noobs who pick up the flag and have no idea what to do with it. Like, if you don't know what to do with the flag, don't pick it up. Just don't be that guy who picks up the flag in Warsaw Dodge. 
doesn't know what to do with the flag, and then runs around like a headless chicken with the flag because you don't know what to do with it. If you don't know what to do with it, don't pick it up. Just don't pick it up. If you don't know what to do with that flag, just don't pick it up. Please, just don't pick it up. You're ruining the game for everybody who knows what to do with that flag. I mean, at that point, if you don't know what to do with the flag, you might as well just right-click the flag and drop it and let somebody else pick it up who knows what to do with the flag. <laughs> something that I'm forgetting, please let me know, because that definitely helps me. And you know where I'm supposed to go? Leave it in the, leave it in the comments section. I'll look, I'll look at the comments of this, this series, and I will... I will go back if there's any quest areas you guys want me it's to do, because I didn't... to those west areas even though even though they probably, by the time I go back and redo them they probably won't give me and they probably won't give me shit a shit ton of experience but that's like if you guys want me to do all of the quests I can but quests that I don't know where I'm going on if you guys play World of Warcraft and you know where I'm supposed to go you guys have to help me on that because my memory is terrible and I'm not gonna know where to go on certain areas. But yeah I can definitely do all of the quests with or all the quest zones for you guys on Farmer P. You know, we'll level them faster that way, guys. I mean, I suppose so. I suppose it's a good thing, actually. Because we'll just level our like, Farmer P here. We'll just level them a little bit faster, which is awesome. Fast levels are always awesome. Glory to the hall. Are those better than our current boots? Be safe. Not by much. Not by much. But the fact that they do give agility and these give intellect. Yeah. What do you need? May your blades never dull. where he's 110. I'll set up I'll set up a playlist. Actually I can do I can set up a playlist today actually for this and then set it to where all of them go into that playlist when they're done. Boulder Fist on my other guy, but let me know if that's wrong. I will change it if Boulder... I will change it.
We can actually queue for dungeons now. Dungeon finder. Random. I'll be leader if it'll give it to me. I don't have a problem with that. <laughs> There's gotta be more grain that will be just collected, because that's only four. There's there's five, right? I mean do we just do we just wait for one of them over here to respawn? I guess that's what we do. Let's just let's just kill shit and wait. <laughs> Do they not respond? Do they not respawn? Okay, we'll have to find the fifth one then. I'm thinking, I'm thinking they don't. I'm thinking they don't. I might be wrong, but I'm thinking they don't. they don't. That means there's a fifth one around here somewhere. There's a fifth grain stack around here somewhere. That I'm missing. I'm just probably glancing over it and not seeing it. I might also do live streams and be playing on my hero, one of my heroes for the day, and you guys get to pick what I do. That might be something we could. That might be something I could do. You guys could just pick what I do. Do these grain sacks not respawn?
Is there one in here? Yeah, there is. Okay, the fifth one's in the fifth one's in the wagon, people. Okay. 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 Fifth one's in the wagon. So we're gonna go back to the crossroads. We're gonna go back to the place of the farm. With the inn by the farm. Let's go back to our boys. And let it be the back to the farm. Oh no, actually no. It looks like we have to return to the photo. Oh well. That's where we gotta return. Let's return to the photo. just unconscious from lack of food. Alright, let's return to our boys at the farm. At the end by the farm. caravan? Did it not make it? That's fine. That's, it's, that's fine. It's 100% fine. We're here. We're at the crossroads now. It's 100% fine. Um, yeah, we're here. We're at the crossroads. It's 100% it's fine. So I think there's a flight path vendor here. There is. Alright, we're gonna end the episode off here on our flight path guy. Strength. And we'll end an episode off here about a flight pack guy. So I will see you guys in the next exciting adventure of our boy, Barco P.
on his journey to 110.